This tutorial will show you how students can complete a PDF-based assignment in Google Classroom. To begin, we will create the assignment. I've already put some instructions in there. We'll call it PDF. We're going to skip the due date and the topic. Now, I'm going to choose my PDF file from Google Drive. If you want to choose it from your computer, you can click on the paperclip right there. But we'll choose Google Drive. And I'm going to choose this one called Example PDF. Click Add. Then we will choose students can, or I'm sorry, make a copy for each student. Then lastly, click on Assign. All right, so now we will see it here in the stream. Let's look at the student's point of view, what they will see. Click on Show to show the stream was updated. There we go. Click on Open. And now you'll see here is that PDF file right here. Okay. So one thing I want to add is that in order to do what I'm about to show you, students must have the Doc Hub app installed in their Chrome browser. Look in the description for this video and I'll, I'll include a link to this app. Okay, so my computer's been a little bit buggy when it comes to this um, and I've noticed some Chromebooks have had a problem with this too where you open it and it should say open with up here but sometimes it just doesn't work. So what you'll do is right click it open it in a new tab. If you do that, the problem is going to be solved. Soon here you'll see at the top it will say open with. Sometimes you have to kind of go up and down. There we go. Open with DACA. So in DACA, what you can do is click on the A right here and you'll be able to type. Put your name. Okay, we'll get rid of that so we can see it. There we go. Uh, you can do a bunch of different things in DACA. Uh, you can click the draw tool. You could circle stuff whatever you want to do. So once students have done that, what they can do is click on the three lines right there, go to download, then save to G Drive. If it says export to G Drive on your computer screen when you do this, that's okay. Yeah, click export or save, they're both going to work. Then click on okay. Now what we need to do is to go back to the assignment here. Now this was the blank assignment. All right, we don't want that blank assignment anymore. We're going to X out of that. Instead, we'll click on Add, go to Google Drive where it was saved, and then in the top left corner, it should show up. You can see the little circle on there. We'll click on it and then go Add. Then click on Turn In. All right, so it, ha it has been submitted. Now, on the teacher's end, we'll be able to see this here. St one student has turned it in. We can click on it and see and you'll see the edits that were made on there. 